I'm on the move. Duly noted. Made it. Gonna look around now. Let's consider that done. <sighs> this is Judge Lawton. Earlier today, our scouts informed me that they have identified multiple Indian stations in the downtown Marshall area. Based on this information, and for your own safety, I'm declaring a lockdown, effective immediately and until further notice. This is a matter for the police, and they will deal with it. clear. I need a breather. Maybe later. This came over the radio a little while ago. I managed to record most of it. We've gotten ourselves into a jam. Sounds like they're in a bad spot. I want to offer them a hand. If you want to check it out, it's on your map. 
I'm lucky they didn't hear that. Nice. the free okay I'll follow your lead let's move Found ya. Tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. We'll be ready. I'll run this home. We'll see you soon. Need a breather.
I'm already loaded down here. I'm loaded up. See you back at base. We'll see you soon. I'll run this home. We'll see you soon. Talk to the boys if you're looking. We've been hearing some rumors on the CB. People out looking for supplies, getting robbed. Stuff like that. I see. And you're the law on this matter, are you? More like a concerned citizen. Well, your concern is noted. But we haven't had any problems here. We look after our own. And you wouldn't know anything about this, would you? Take a walk with me, will you? Let me see if I can't explain how things are. Funny thing about people, they don't much like to challenge their assumptions. Now me and my brother, we done pretty well for ourselves in all this. Other folks see that and, well, it is in the character of very few men to honor without envy a friend who has prospered. Aeschylus said that, and an envious man is a man who will spread rumors about his neighbors. Right, because normally gun-running moonshiners are such upstanding citizens. Because we're businessmen. It's all about seeing the long game. Rob a man, and he'll give you what he's got in his pockets. You sell him what he wants, though, what he needs, and he'll keep on coming back to give you everything he has. Did Aeschylus say that, too? Here, let's ask Mickey. Mickey! Our friend here is curious if we've been stealing from our fellow survivors. Seems there are rumors to that effect. <laughs> Shit. If we was, wouldn't be anybody to spread no rumors. See? Nothing to it. Now why don't you run along, and if we hear anything, you'll be the first to know. Pretty sure they know something about it at least. Perfect. Our friends and neighbors. What should we do? I think for now, we just tell our runners to stay extra sharp. We don't want to antagonize the Wilkerson's if we don't have to. All right, I'll let everybody know. You watch yourself out there too. Something. 
Looks like an infestation. That should do it. I'm on the move. Copy that. That's not good. Can I just go on the record and, and say that that really sucked? Glad you stopped by. Fact is, we're never gonna make it on our own. Not like you folks have. Not like a charity case or anything. We'll work. You better get ready. We'll be on them soon as we keep going. Okay, that's all we needed. This is good, right? I mean, it doesn't suck. Last clip. Better make it count. I'm on the move. Okay. There are still a few things to do out there. Jack, do you copy? Damn it, man, where are you? 
You might want to go check it out. Shit, that's gonna bring trouble. Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. Roger that. We'll be waiting. <laughs> Consider this one searched. Anybody home? Okay? Come on, we gotta get going. I'm done here. Heads up. We've got zombie activity at 2 o'clock. Almost there. Found this while I was out. Mm, what you got? Oh, you know, stuff. 
You got it from here? Okay, that's all we needed. I can't thank you enough. Uh, should we? I'm on. Cool. Let's head down towards Marshall. I think I know a place that might suit us. Or we can just drive around for a while and see what we see. Your call. Last clip. Better make it count. that with you and Lily? Hmm. It's a long story. Not much on the radio to fill the time. Good point. My mom died when I was 13. Lily was nine. I'm sorry. Yeah. Anyways, not long after that was when Lily was diagnosed. And our dad, he was, um, he's kind of a wreck. I had to pick up a lot of that slack. Jacob, I need you to be a man. Help take care of your sister. You know what I mean? It was a lot for a kid to live up to. And I didn't handle it well. And as soon as I turned 18, I told my dad that I was moving to Danforth and I was going to college. Go on. Oh, man. Man, we blew up. We had a huge fight. Didn't talk for years after that. I finally... This could work. Nice size, remote enough so there's not too many zombies. Remote enough we'd have to drive to get anywhere, but I see your point. Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. Roger that. We'll be waiting. Zombies coming up behind us. <laughs> Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. We'll see you soon. Okay. Looks like no zombies were close by. All quiet here. Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. We'll be ready. Could be trouble on the left. Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. Roger that. We'll be waiting.
Wouldn't be a bad idea to set up here. I'm loaded up. See you back at base. We'll be ready. Zombies up ahead. Go through, go around. I'm loaded up. See you back at base. Roger that. We'll be waiting. I'm loaded up. See you back at base. Roger that. We'll be waiting. Well, what do you think? Check this place out. It's got a big yard, a privacy wall that we can fortify pretty easily, and check out that tree fort. We could turn that into a watchtower easy. You seem pretty excited about this place. Yeah, well, yeah, when I was a kid, my best friend Sally, she lived in this house. And I was so jealous. I always wanted to live here. Well then, let's take a look inside. Jesus! Who's... I can't see... Help me... What the hell was that? Bees me. That... That didn't look like any disease I've ever seen. You? Nope. Maybe we gotta go, huh? I'll run this home. We'll see you soon. Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. We'll be ready. We've got this place locked down. I'm loaded up. See you back at base. We'll be ready. I'll run this home. We'll see you soon. I'll run this home. We'll see you soon.
Looks like a good spot for an outpost. Are you sure? That's a big decision. Yeah. Tell the... I'll run this home. We'll be ready. Well, that's a few options at least. There might be more out there if you look around. I'll think about it. Sure. Big decision, I get it. Just remember, tree fort. I think we better move our base down here. Are you sure? That's a big decision. It's time for a change in scenery. How's it going? I'm almost there. Goddamn miracle. Thanks for coming to get me. I'm ready to leave now. See you around. We might be able to hold off another attack, if we're lucky. We might want to set up a few more outposts. There you go. Don't say I never gave you nothing. Hmm, what you got? Oh, you know, stuff. A relief. <laughs> Found this while I was out. My hero. 